Right, so after a very successful summer swimming for everyone, it's uh, mid-September and one of the things that I noticed is uh, I could heat the pool up quite quickly, 24, 25, but it wasn't very good at retaining the heat and uh, I think that's largely because uh, you've got concrete surrounding it. Um, a layer of uh, fiberglass is going to have better thermal qualities and I can also gel coat it and get a better finish so here we are, I've ground her all out um, just with a disc grinder with a sandpaper on the end of it and you can see I've done a trial piece over there and I would say that was pretty successful I was just going to paint over the top of the tiles but I don't see any reason to actually I just use uh, flow coat over the top of that but you can see that that's uh, let's go down in the hole you can see that that's been pretty successfully adhesed to the wall and uh, I see no reason why that should go anywhere anytime soon so yeah so I just rolled on obviously I've got quite a job on my hands here and got 50 litres of uh, resin and 30 kilograms of 600 gram fiberglass mat. Hopefully that's going to be enough. But those sides go on a treat. Uh, all the words of wisdom say put the fiberglass vertically just so that you can manage it. I haven't got anyone to help me so I'm just running about on my own. Well, I think that's pretty successful. Okay, more soon as I progress.